Hey everybody, this video I'll be showing you guys how you can move a house. So if any of you have a mobile home or trailer park, this will be awesome in your city. So hopefully you all enjoy this tutorial and let's get this started. Alright guys, in this video we'll be doing something that I've never seen anybody else do in Minecraft. Now we will be building the truck first that's going to be hauling the mobile home away. The trailer is going to be right here with the mobile home on top. And right there is going to be where the mobile home was. So again, this truck is pulling the mobile home away and hauling it off in that direction. So let's go ahead and start with the truck tires. This is going to be the actual front tire right here and we're going to be using the block of coal for the tires now they're going to be three blocks apart just like this now on this side we're going to skip another three blocks and place a tire skip a block tire skip a block tire again we're going to be doing the truck first so these back four right here are on the actual trailer that we'll do later on so never mind those right now so let's go ahead and skip these three blocks, place the tire there, and just go ahead and copy this other side, just like this. Alright, now once you've got that, then go ahead and grab your buttons, your stone buttons, and place them on all of these truck tires. Alright, now let's go ahead and grab the stone slabs. On the front of the truck, we're going to be doing the front bumper right behind the front tower we're going to be placing the cobblestone half slab right here and then we're going to be doing the whole rest of this truck with the stone slab it's going to be looking really derpy I will say that but it'll look real good once it's all the way done so just go ahead and take this stone slab and fill all of this in real quick alright now once you've got that then take the stone slab and double the back up right here on these three tires go ahead and place the stone slab on top well actually we're going to be placing the iron trap door on the back ones but these other four here we're going to be placing the stone slab like this well, alright now what we're going to do is take the stone slab and go ahead and double this up all of this on the back of this truck just like that right here go ahead and add three more and then right here go ahead and take this out place an anvil right there cobblestone stair right here and a cobblestone stair right here alright now let's move to the front of the truck let's go ahead and get our furnaces go ahead and place a furnace right here in the middle like this and then what you're gonna need to do is go on top of this furnace crouch place another one that way it's facing the same way now right here we're going to be placing two more furnaces but face them like this and then do the same thing over here just like this once you've got that then get your ladders and place your ladders on all of the furnaces like this then grab your choice of stair I'm using the birch and I'm going to place one here and just see that there that's a little bit of detail that's why we turned it and we're going to do the same thing over here, upside down stair. And then a block of choice. I'm using the light gray concrete right here on the front of the truck. And then this is where the headlights are going to go. So go ahead and do this. Well, all right, now let's go ahead and move on this side of the truck. And grab your choice of stair again and place it like this. And do the same thing right on top of this cobblestone half slab like this 
then grab your choice of half slab using the birch and go ahead and place it right here above the tire now just grab any old block we're just gonna block this in right here and then what we're gonna do now is grab the light gray concrete come up like this on both sides go ahead and fill this in just like that and then put your wood button right here for the door handle on both sides grab an iron bar right here for the handle to get up in the truck and let's go ahead and black this in now grab your black stained glass put it right here now let's get the birch wood half slab and go on top right here in the middle I'm gonna take the stair turn it this way cover it around like this now right here we're going to be putting the black stained glass panes for the mirrors well, alright now let's go ahead and move to the back of the truck right here and I'm gonna be using the chisel quartz block only because it looks kind of like a metal block so choose a metal looking block in place right there with your cobblestone wall here and then grab your choice of fence I'm using another brick and come up by three on top of this cobblestone wall just like this now put your full block of cobblestone right here with a cobblestone stair here and here an iron truck door here and then stone button here and stone button here well, alright now grab the light gray concrete and go right here like this and you're going to take it all the way down like this and we're gonna make a 4 by 5 so it's 1 2 3 4 go ahead and fill this in real quick now right here where this anvil is we're going to be placing the weighted pressure plate right there now we're gonna grab the light gray concrete do this place the trip wire hook there a lever there and then an upside down cobblestone stair right there alright now once you've got that now go ahead and come back here and come down like this and then bring it on across like this now grab the stone slabs and place across the top of there well, alright now grab the gray carpet and place three of them right here place a button here do the same thing on this side a trip wire hook here the same thing on this side and then right here we're going to be adding one two three of the stone slabs one two three both sides and then the light gray concrete we're going to be doing a three by three right here now grab your stone pressure plates and line them up right here now we're going to be doing the trailer here so we're going to take the tires place one here and again the stone buttons on these tires skip a block and place another tire right here again this is connected to the trailer off that hitch alright now go on this side and it's going to be two blocks from this tire again do the same thing as the other side now we're going to be counting some blocks so right here going to the back of the truck it's going to be one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one blocks the twenty first block you place a tire you should have twenty blocks from here 
to that tire. 20 blocks. The 21st block, place your tire. Alright, then skip a block, place a tire, skip a block, place tire, skip a block, place tire. Do the same thing on this side. Again, you're going to skip three blocks here and just match it up on the other side just like that. Then do what we've done already and put your stone buttons on these tires. Alright, now let's go ahead and connect this up with these stone slabs. So go right in here and let's put the stone slabs in between these tires. And then go ahead and take that all the way back until you get to this back tire like this. Now you're going to do this on both sides and you're going to hang off one, two, three, four off the back. And then go ahead and place one like this. And then this is going to be the back bumper. So go ahead and fill all this in real quick with the stone slab. Connect this up like this here. And again, fill all this in real quick. And now you should have this here. All right, now with the stone slab and the cobblestone stair, we're going to be going down here. The stone slab, go ahead and double this up like this. Then take the cobblestone stair upside down right here. The stone slab right here and count one, two, three. Right here, we're going to be doing the upside down cobblestone stair. One, two, three. Upside down cobblestone stair. One, two, three. And do the same thing till we get all the way to the end here. Just like this. One, two, three. One, two, three. Hopefully you guys do enjoy this tutorial. Again, I haven't seen anybody else do this before. Alright, now when you get back here, take this stair and wrap it around like this. So go ahead and do that over here on this other side as well. So we're going to take the Cobblestone stair like this. Go right here. One, two, three. And do the same thing that we've done over there. Well, Alright, now you should have this. Now let's go ahead and grab the stone slab. And just go ahead and fill the rest of this in. Just like that. And now on the back of here the back bumper take the stone slab and come off like this then take the cobblestone half slab and connect all this up in between the cobblestone stairs all the way down and do this side the same way as well. Just like that. Alright, now right here, let's double this up. Let's take the cobblestone stair, place it. We need it to go upside down. So let's do this here. And now right here we're going to double this up like this. Alright. Take your item frame, place one here, one here, and then your choice of tail lights. And then I'm going to be using the dark oak wood slab. 
and I'm gonna place it right here on this cobblestone on both sides all the way down on this mobile home just like this so let's do this one so right here all the way down and now you should have this well, alright now grab the iron trap door the terracotta and the brown terracotta is what I'm gonna be using on this trailer alright now the iron trap door on the back tire right here we're just gonna go ahead and drag this all the way down right here and then in between these tires and all the way on the back like this so let's go ahead and go on this side and do the same thing so the iron trap door is here between the tires and then all the way down until you get to this tire here alright now I'm gonna be using the regular terracotta and I'm gonna go on top of all this on top of the uh, dark oak slabs you guys can use all different colors as you see I have a whole trailer park assorted with different colors there so you guys can use your imagination on the colors and just go ahead and come along the back like this and go ahead and go on this side as well now this is only going to be three blocks tall counting this block here so this is one and I'm going to do two more layers here and I'm going to be using the brown terracotta to kind of give it a you know a little bit more of a look because we are building a mobile home and a mobile home isn't going to look all that fancy in Minecraft if you don't make it look fancy so just go ahead and fill all of this in and we will go back and uh, do like the doors and the windows so just go ahead and fill all this in real quick well, alright you should have this here now go ahead and come down here and let's make the tongue of this mobile home with the cobblestone wall and place it like this this is the actual hookup or they pull the trailer up with so go ahead and put that right there and then what we're gonna do now is go ahead and place some doors and some windows so it's gonna be all pretty much random so you're gonna have a front door and a back door so just go ahead and knock out these here there's a door and you're gonna most of the time have a window on both sides of the door again this is all going to be random so that's going to be like the living room or whatever like that and then you're going to have like a kitchen maybe a little bit bigger of a window there and then you're going to have back here like a bathroom so the window is going to be up higher and then there's always going to be like a back room the window like that and then let's go ahead and do something like this not too many windows but you gotta try to map it out like where the kitchen is and everything like that don't overthink it either so right here I'm gonna go ahead and knock out these three that's gonna be like a kitchen window there and then go ahead and place your black stained glass panes in here on all of your windows and we also need to do a back door so if you're gonna have a door there you are usually gonna have a door back here so I'm just gonna go ahead and again this is pretty much all random don't really overthink it so just go ahead and put all these windows in real quick and then what we're gonna do is what I usually do with the black concrete and just go in behind it and black all of it out because this is only gonna be for looks nobody's gotta go on the inside the inside's not gonna be done so just go ahead and do this and go on the inside with your black concrete and fill all this in and also the doors that way if anybody was to open the door it blocks them and they can't you know get in or anything like that so just go ahead and go on all of these windows and fill all of this in real quick 
All right, now once you have it all blacked out like this, then grab your buttons of choice and then place them right there. This is like the reflectors on the actual mobile home. All right, now let's go ahead and do a roof on here. So I'm gonna take this block on up over these three windows on each side, just like that, and then grab stone brick slabs and hang off of both ends like this by one block and you're gonna take the stone slab all the way down until you get to the other end and again you're gonna hang it off by one like this so go ahead and do this other side the same way go ahead and carry it all the way down and then we're gonna go ahead and use the stone brick stairs right here you're gonna do this also on both sides just like this and now what we're gonna do is wrap this around like this and do this on this side too so wrap it around and now grab the stone brick slabs again place three up here go like this you can do something like this. It's all up to you guys. Make it look fancy. Or you can just take the slab. Like this. I think that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to do that on this other side. I'm going to take this stair out place the slab here and then place the slabs across here like that and then up here just take these slabs on the top and just drag them all the way down and just go ahead and fill all this in and there you go guys I hope that you all enjoy this tutorial if so please hit that like button Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you guys think down below. And I'll see you all next time.